A lot of you iPhone 3G owners may have upgraded to the latest iOS 4, but if you aren't really happy because your phone seems more sluggish or you aren't getting the benefit of multitasking anyways, you probably wish you could go back. I'm Brian Tong from CNET.com and I'll show you how to downgrade your iPhone 3G back to iPhone OS 3.1.3. Now, big thanks to Lifehacker for showing me how to complete the downgrade process. This method has worked consistently for iPhone 3G users, but as always, proceed with caution. Now, to get started, we'll need to have a few things in place. First up, get the restore file for the iPhone OS 3.13. Now, it still might be on your computer's hard drive from previous updates, so on a Mac, look for it here. And for Windows users, you can find it at this location on your hard drive. If you can't find it, head on over to iClarified's website where all the software updates have been archived and look for this specific file. You'll need one more piece of software called RecBoot. It's Mac and Windows compatible and you can download it from this location. It's a utility that will help us finish the downgrade process. All right, let's get to it. The first thing you want to do is connect your phone to your computer and then power it down by holding the power sleep button and sliding to power off. Once it's off, hold the power button and the home button together for 10 seconds then remove just your finger from the power button and remain holding down just the home button for 10 more seconds. This will put the phone into device firmware update mode. Now if you did it correctly, iTunes will show a prompt that it sees a phone in recovery mode and you can press OK. You'll see your phone in the device's sidebar in iTunes and make sure you click on it. Then to initiate the downgrade process on a Mac, hold the option key on your keyboard and press the restore button with your mouse. For Windows users, hold down the shift button while you click restore. Now you'll have to locate the iPhone OS 3.13 firmware file and select it as the one you want to restore your phone with. The restore process will start and it takes about 10 minutes. Once it's done, you'll probably see an error message like this one and your phone will show a connect to iTunes screen. But don't worry guys, this is totally normal. Now open up the RecBoot app we downloaded and click exit recovery mode. You're going to want to wait a few seconds and your phone will then get out of recovery mode and it will now be ready to sync with iTunes with the previous iPhone OS 3.13 installed. Now I want to emphasize this is specifically for the iPhone 3G. This does not involve any jailbreaking and you might have different results, but this worked for us. But that's how you downgrade your iPhone 3G from iOS 4 to OS 3.13. Use it wisely.